Good evening, this is your AI host, Jay. I'm here with the automatically generated, Jernita, evening headlines on August 13, 2023. Ukraine desperate for help clearing mines, says Defense Minister. The Guardian, Russia-Ukraine war, four types of landmines and how they work. Nights at the opera and days in the piazza, the joy of visiting Verona. Extremely large lizard kept in dog kennel after being found in Guernsey. Russian troops forced to retreat as Ukraine retakes key Donetsk village. The Independent, Ukraine war latest, Belarus may now be funding Wagner Group, Mod says, seven killed after Russian shelling in Kherson. Sky News, Wagner Group may now be funded by Belarus. Evening Standard, Blackwater paved the way for Wagner. Al Jazeera English, why would the Wagner mercenaries leave Belarus just weeks after arriving? DW News. Family of Utah man shot dead by FBI after threats to Biden say he was frustrated. The Independent, Truth Social warned the FBI about plot against Biden. Why can't other platforms track such threats? Forbes, Utah man killed in raid linked to threats against Biden. Reuters, Rising political threats take U.S. into uncharted territory as 2024 election looms. Trump ignores indictments in Iowa as Georgia grand jury to meet this week, live. The Independent, Judge Chutkin warns Trump against inflammatory remarks before trial. BBC, Shush is not gonna have the campaign run in her courtroom, John Dean weighs in on Trump court ruling. CNN, U.S. judge warns there are limits to what Trump can say about the election case. Fire put out at fertilizer warehouse in Moscow region, agencies. Reuters, watch, search teams comb rubble after factory explosion close to Moscow. The Independent, fire breaks out a few miles away from Vladimir Putin's official residence. Evening Standard, video, large fire breaks out at fertilizer warehouse in Moscow region. WION, explosion caused by gas leak kills two in residential building in Russia. Russia fires warning shots at Ukraine-bound cargo ship in Black Sea. The Independent, Russian Navy fires warning shots at cargo ship in Black Sea. Euronews, Russian warship fires warning shots at cargo ship in Black Sea. Sky News, Russia says fired warning shots at cargo vessel heading towards Ukraine port. The Moscow Times, Russia fires warning shots at cargo ship in Black Sea. Ecuador, thousands of soldiers move gang leader Fito. BBC, Ecuador murder, Fernando Villavicencio's running mate steps into contest election. BBC, I'm not afraid, Ecuador's assassinated presidential candidate who fought the cartels. The Guardian, the Guardian view on murder in Ecuador, a tide of violence reaches new heights. The Guardian, opinion, Fernando Villavicencio's assassination could doom Ecuador's democracy. Mudslide in northwestern Chinese city leaves 21 dead and 6 missing. The Guardian, China, 21 people killed in mudslide, as nearly 1,000 rescue workers search for missing six. Sky News, death toll in China mudslide rises to 21, with six people missing. The Independent, heavy rains trigger deadly mudslide in northwest China. Guardian News, death toll from mudslide in China's Xi'an rises to 21. Hawaii wildfire becomes deadliest in modern US history as death toll tops 93 latest. The Independent, Hawaii Fire's latest news, Hawaii's wildfire fanned by winds, historic town burnt to cinders. India Today, Maui Fire, 93 killed as governor warns of significant death toll rise. BBC, Maui resident, the heartbreaking moment I saw my house for the last time. This was all for the news. Thanks for listening. Please do not forget to like and subscribe.